since 20 centimeters represents a log of 10, then 20 times 0.301, the log of 2, gives us 6.02 centimeters for the number 2. By using the partially graded slide rule, moving the beginning to the number 2, we can then calculate the products of 2 times 2 and 2 times 3, which gives us the logs for 4 and the log for 6. Now move the 2 to where the 10 position is, right after the 9, and go back to the beginning of the slide, which is where the 1 is. That will give us 10 divided by 2, which is equal to the law of 5 for us. Since the primes cannot be found by a product, we must put those markings on in the same way we did with the other integers. We're now starting with 11 and 13. For primes greater than 13, such as 17 and 19, we can take the midpoint between the adjacent numbers and get a reasonably accurate position for those primes. 